It's summertime, guys, and you know what that means, blender cocktails. And as Julie Reiner has shown us, and I'm about to show you, blender cocktails don't always have to be cheesy. They can be pretty amazing. Today we're going to be doing Julie Reiner's banana daiquiri. Uh, and if you don't know who Julie Reiner is, you should know who Julie Reiner is. She is a bar owner and uh, beverage consultant in New York City. Uh, she is a protege of Dale DeGroff, and she owns or co-owns uh, bars such as the Flatiron Lounge, uh, Clover Club and the now closed Pegu Club. Unfortunately, it's closed. Uh, but, uh, and I think she actually owns a little bit of Leenda as well with Ivy Mix. All right, let's get into making this cocktail. My ice is melting. I don't want to do a, like a whole protracted thing. The people who always complain that I talk too much uh, are going to be happy that we're getting into the cocktail fast. But I will say this to the people who think I talk too much. I may talk too much. That may be true. But at the same time, you did click on a channel that was called The Educated Barfly. So what did you expect? All right, that's fair, right, Marius? Yeah. All right. First thing we're going to do is a half an ounce of Demerara syrup. We're doing a one-to-one -one Demerara syrup today. Putting it into our blender. Then we are doing half an ounce of lime juice. Putting that into our blender. Then we're going to peel this banana, since it is a banana daiquiri. And by... And by peel it, I mean tear it apart, like a person who has never actually peeled a banana before. Throw that over there and use it for banana. We're gonna use that for uh, for banana banana peel syrup later. Then we're gonna to toss that in there. I'm gonna grab a little this guy and do a little job on my finger poos. All right, here we go. Now that our fingers are clean, we can continue. We're gonna do one ounce of Gaffard Banana du Brazil. This is what the drink originally called for, but if you do not have it and you have another banana liqueur or another banana liqueur that is uh, available to use, you can use that. So one ounce, one ounce of white rum. I like using the Saison Pale, which is one of my absolute favorites right now. And then one ounce Jamaican, we're doing Appleton Signature. Into the glass, into the, I was going to say the glass, but really it's actually a blender poo. All right, and then we're going to do an, a, a cup and a half of crushed ice. I'm using a half, half cup measure here. You can use crushed. I'm actually using pebble. Well, it's kind of pebbly crushed now that it's been around for fun out a little while. Yeah, they're the opal nuggets. Yeah, they're opal nuggets. Yeah, but they're like, they're actually like, I've like ice picked these mm. to the point where they're now like, it's kind of like crushed and and uh, pebble. That's the, that's the problem with pebble is that when pebble gets old, it kind of gets that way. All right, and then we're gonna give it a nice blend. We're gonna blend that till it is smooth. Make sure we Make sure we don't have a lot of big pieces left in there, of uh, ice I mean, because sometimes the ice will kind of ad adhese together like that. So you want to break all that, that ice up. All right, then we're going to take it, take our glass and we're going to put our blender cocktail in there, blender daiquiri. Okay, and then we are going to, I thought it would be kind of fun to do like a little, a little uh, caramelized, Banana. So what I did here is I have a little bit of sugar in here. I put my banana in there and I'm just sort of tossing it around so it coats it nice and evenly. I'm going to take a toothpick and put my banana slice on my toothpick like so. And then I'm going to give it a little torch and caramelize the sugar on top. Careful not to get your, your, your little tootsies too, because uh, nobody wants a burn injury today. Hey, yeah, you don't want those little piggies to go to the hospital. I really don't want to. I don't want to go anywhere near a hospital right now, so I'm being extra special careful. There you go. You just sort of give it a nice even flame with a torch. 
If you don't, you can just do a regular banana if you don't have a torch, it's fine. Or you can put it on the, uh, the skillet and stove top and just kind of like... Oh, you could kind of do that. Yeah, you could caramelize it on the skillet as well, yeah. And then... Uh, the pan, whatever you want to call it. Whoop. Just ah, sink no. it in there. Mm. Well, you know what? This was like supposed to be so much more... Elegant? Well, it was supposed to be so much more... I was trying to like... Ah, sometimes I get lucky and I can like balance it on the rim. You know what I could do is cut a slit in it. I'll just... Man, I gotta get my knife out and everything. I just like cut a slit in it. I wanted to use an umbrella, but it's not as... Um... There you go. There you go. It's not as... Uh, it's not as... Um... I don't know, ice got a little bit too melty, I think. Let's see if it's over diluted. Oh, hell it's not. That's not over diluted at all. Mmm, that is good. And it's really nice about that. Is that, you know, the Kafar Banana of Brazil has like a really nice kind of banana flavor, but then just coupled with just like fresh banana, um, is just, it just, it's just so good. So you get a little bit of that lime juice, you get a little bit of the simple syrup. You know, this is gonna be pretty sweet on its own even though it is a liqueur. It's about 25% alcohol. Um, it's not as sweet as sugar would be. So, you know, you get this little Demerara syrup and you're kind of bringing those sort of molasses style flavors into it on top of the Banana du Brazil and just kind of eating itself out. You get a little bit of the acid from the lime juice, just enough. And then you get like a nice, you know, sort of tropical pop from the Jamaican rum and then kind of supported by that white rum. So there it is, uh, Julie Reiner's Banana Daiquiri. Go get it, Blender Cocktails this summer all the way. If you like our channel, please hit like and subscribe. Uh, check out our uh, YouTube memberships. We got some YouTube memberships. We're gonna be doing some live streams and uh, 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 we're gonna start instituting some, hopefully anyway, we're gonna start instituting some, uh, some uh, cocktail, uh, cocktails cocktail videos just for them because mm -hmm. they get perks oh I, they, we, they we, are members. we have one that's coming out that's like an extended cut Ooh, yeah or extended cuts i'm trying to get marius to do a blooper reel there's gonna be lots of fun stuff plus uh we stopped doing our weekly live streams so we're gonna be doing some live streams regular for regular youtube but we're gonna be longer live we're gonna be doing longer live streams for uh for members. members and then members might get some videos on us building out our new bar and all that kind of good jazz so there it is i don't know Go get the blender daiquiri, become a member, uh, get a Stagger League Goods apron, and if you do, try type in Barfly SLG20 at checkout, and I'll see you guys on another time.